Hey everybody, it's Gary the Google Guy here and today I want to just let you know about some improvements to the content organization and your table properties in case you have not explored that lately. Now you can do this in a couple of ways. You can go to your table, you can then go to the format menu and down near the middle of our window there you'll see the table option and then down near the bottom you'll see table properties in that menu. Now me personally, I usually just go and click inside of one of my cells I'll right click and then in that menu, it pops up near the bottom. You'll see table properties. And then to the right side of the screen, it will pop out a little window. Now what's kind of nice about this is you got all these different pull down menus to be able to select and really customize your table to what you would like. For example, the table itself. Maybe there's a different style that you want to use for inline or wrapping text. Your different alignment of left, center or right side justification and so on and so forth. I won't bore you with all those different things. Just know you can customize things with your columns, your rows, your cells, and even your color schemes if you would like to do some of that stuff too. So you do have that power to be able to do some things from this table properties format option if you would like. You can also do this for any of the tables that you use that are building blocks or your table templates that maybe you've inserted. You can right click on those once again, the same kind of thing, table properties, and then you can customize maybe a little bit more what has already been provided. So with that, until we meet again, another day, another time, another tip, trick, hack, or update, this is Gary the Google Guy, signing off.